Hey everyone, we are back with what's sold on eBay for Wednesday. Starting off the video, quite a bit of sales, babe. How did we do today? You, see, look at that. We had 16 sales for five. We just sold ten. one, so she's doing the math. Just over five ten. So a pretty good day again. Q4, we're happy. Uh, busy day for us on Wednesdays with church and everything. So we got to get this all packed up, list a couple things, and then go to bed. So anything you want to say? No. Next item. Go no, first item. Is this, is this it? No. No. You were your screen. Yeah, your screen was at the top. So whoops. Sneak peek. First item, guys, a bestie buy. This is a Craftsman combination wrench, an eight millimeter. It is vintage, and it sold for ten dollars shipped. We've been parting out the wrenches. Guy. $10. Yeah, a little tool there. All right, we sold one. <laughs> Made another couple of those in my life. Um, anyways, uh, that item, uh, we sold one the other day for like a 9mm, a 7, and the person got it and said, thanks, I lost mine for my set, so this now completes it. So that's probably what people are buying. If they lose one, they want to get the replacement one. Uh, if you have a whole set, you can part them out, but we seem to be doing better selling the one. We didn't have a complete set, selling them as one individual piece, and we're doing okay. 10 bucks goes out first class. We're making 5 bucks on it. Cool. Next item. Next, Next item is this Microsoft original Xbox console bundle. It does get, you do get Halo and a controller and all the wires to do play the game. Shout out to my Halo fans out there. And we sold it for $108. This shit. one's been listed though for quite a few months. I list. Halo fans? Yeah. Is it your no, fans? No, just people just who are fans, of, fans Halo. of Halo. Yeah, I don't think there's any of my fans out there. Cameron used to be a semi pro no, Halo a, player. We were trying to be, we were competing to be a Halo player. He literally went to competitions and everything guys with my boys nerd. nerd anyways um this was listed i think like at the heart after covid prices were really high but it's kind of come down on sales now it finally sold because christmas time i got two more of these xboxes to test and list so hopefully we can get those sold as well next item this is an infinity in usb one digital foot pedal um for a transcriber yep and it sold for twenty nine dollars shipped. A little scuffs on there. Uh, model number dirt. on the back. Anyways, with these, I bought like six of them from one of my sources at a garage sale, and um, I think I paid like twenty five bucks for everything I bought that day. We made quite a bit of money. These do pretty well. Um, they go to transcribers. There's ones that are official brands, and there's these Infinity ones that are just like they appear to be aftermarket ones or whatever, but they still sell. Next, Next we item. got a Funko Pop. This is a Disney Funko Pop. This is Dory from Finding Dory. Number 192 for those of you taking notes. And she sold for 13 and a half ships. Not in perfect shape. She was a dollar at a garage sale. Then we've got a Samsung we'll DVD player. Okay. And that one, it does have the it's remote. It just a... doesn't say it, but it's a combo. Oh, okay. It does have the remote and the wires. And it sold for a $90 ship. That one we listed the same day that I listed the one I sold yesterday. And that <coughs> one sold for $75. This one sold for $90. So we did pretty well on those two DVD combos there. Then we've got Mel Bay. Oh, and on the combos, like I mentioned, we have been buying remotes for them. This one I have the remote for, but we're buying remotes to make the unit more complete. Next item. This one we've got is Mel Bay's Complete Book of Guitar Chords, Scales, and Arpeggios. And that one sold for eighteen dollars and some change. Pretty good there, medium mail item. We're happy about that. We Another sold. iPad Air box. We, we haven't sold, sold many of these before sold, this. But yeah, we, we sold like, like five or, or six. Five, yeah. yeah, they just keep selling. And this is a, a iPad Air Wi-Fi one, and it sold for ten dollars and some the, change. The Air, this kind of iPad one should go first class. So we'll make a little it bit did. of money. We're just happy to see them get out of here. I'm not going to list the iPad ones. I'm going to stick to the watches and the phone, the newer phone ones for the most part. Or the MacBooks. People buy the MacBook boxes. Oh, well, we got it all bubble wrapped up. It's going to need more than this. These are the Bolswawik um, salt and pepper shakers. Um, it does come with the cute little dish for them that matches. And those sold for $20 and some change. Not a whole lot there, but we'll get them out of here. They'll, they'll go over a pound, I think. They're yeah. not going to be. So we won't make much money on that one. But that Polish pottery we've done very well on. You look at our other videos. Google it. You know, stop your video so you can spell out the name because we don't know how to pronounce it. But... <laughs> You can type Ball. it down in the bottom right there. No, I probably won't do that. B O L E S L A W I E. -C. You know how to pronounce that. Hit us up. Anyways. <laughs> Next up, we got this vintage Panasonic um, electronic stapler. Yep. And that one sold for $24. Shipped. I don't know if it'll go on a padded. Probably not. So these do okay. You know, you only want to pick them up for like a buck or so if you're going to make any money on them. Yeah. Then another box only. This is a Nintendo Switch box. 
just the just box. Just the box, nothing, no manuals or anything. Yeah, nothing in it, and that one sold for 22 and a half shipped. I'm just a sucker for video game boxes, so I always grab this as a dollar, so we're, we're going to make it's a little not, bit of money. Oh, I'm going to say it's not from Noah's. <laughs> no, this isn't Noah's. Oh, okay. um, this is what I got from Josh, so. Bestie bye. Then we've got Kirstie Alley's Fat Actress, the complete first season. Sealed. Sealed. Not a whole lot. And that sold for seven dollars and some change. Probably be worth more. I think it was a dollar, but listed anyways to make a few bucks on it. This one was good. This is relational concepts and psychoanalysis, and that one Very sold for intriguing. forty-five dollars. Shipped. That was an offer to watcher. Is usually interesting concept, but I mean like uh, books or things you don't really see a lot about. I'll look them up because sometimes those tend to be valuable. So. Then we've got Chrissy Teigen's cookbook for it's from the called Cravings, buy. and that one sold for twelve dollars and some change. Originally, it was thirty, so it's really depreciated. Apparently, people don't really need it. But it I think she's got like a new one. That's why. Cravings number two. <laughs> um, this one is from the Rolling Stones. By this is the Verve Urban Hymns. This is a good one right here. Uh, guys. Cassette, and that one sold for twenty-two dollars. And it sold pretty quickly in a couple weeks. So I mean, not a crazy money, but twenty-two bucks for a used cassette is still pretty good. So yeah. we're happy about that. We sell like ten and twelve dollar ones. So now oh, we showed you earlier. This is a razor seat from the Crazy Cart. Um, it is the replacement, and it does come with the bolts it's dusty and everything. It's been in here a minute. Yeah, it's so annoying. Is it the one that's sitting there, yeah. cart, taking up room? And that one sold for thirty dollars shipped. We bought that. Or I pulled that cart out of the dumpster at our first, well, probably our second apartment at the time. I pulled it out. <laughs> Took off the wheels. We already sold the wheels. They were those big, solid ones. I sold like two or three wheels, and then I sold another piece off it, and then I finally sold the seat, and it was free. Oh, We're not going to make a bunch on this one because it only sold for 30 bucks. It's a bigger big. item. It's going to New York. It doesn't weigh a whole lot, but it's probably going to cost us 15, 16 York. bucks. But we made a bunch of money on the wheels and the other stuff, and again, it cost us nothing. So yeah. that was pretty cool. Whenever in doubt, part it out. And this one, right as we were about to start the video, this person paid. This is a Wrangler Western shirt. Uh, yeah. It's uh, like half black, half white with a big old red stripe on it. It's yeah. pretty crazy. It's got um, pearl snaps. It does have pearl snaps. Gotta love those. And that sold for $24 shipped. Still pick up the Westerns for a couple bucks, maybe five most. A lot of them will sell if they got a good pattern, but not as well as they used to. We have a few items waiting on payment. One's pretty big. We'll see if it actually comes through. And then a manual sold this morning on an offer, but they haven't paid. So hopefully that'll happen. Uh, Linda will be, I'll probably be back if anything else sells actually, because she's got stuff to do. She got her job tomorrow. So I'll probably be back if anything else sells. But if not, we'll see you both. Uh, we'll see both of us will be back Thursday with what sells in the next clip. So take care. Bye-bye. Hey everyone, we are back with the sales for Thursday. Almost Friday here, one more day at work. Linda had all of her work today for her job. She got it all done in one day. My back hurts. <laughs> She's exhausted. It's a busy time here, and we still got some stuff to uh, show you guys for eBay sales. How did we do today? You remember? We had 15 sales for just under 370. So not a lot of like low dollar stuff, kind of bread and butter stuff. Nothing real crazy, but enough to you know. Keep the bills paid, keep the lights on here. We have been doing some different things at the end of the video, showing some pictures every once in a while. So if you'd like to see what's going on with the family, stay tuned at the end of the video. I'll try to show some little pictures. Not every video, but every once in a while to keep you guys in the loop about how we're doing and things that might be fun in our life. So let's get into it. First item. Oh, snack update or life update. Okay, first item. First item we got is this vintage NASCAR Dale Earnhardt shirt. Um, it's a size XL and it sold for $15 shipped. Oh, I love this whole table we have with everything spread out. It makes it so easy. I say this all the time, but you don't understand how frustrating it was with this little tiny space to stack 40 items. Now we have a lot more, like triple the space probably. Even though it did have le levels on it, we could have used those levels if you had emptied them out. No, there. She says levels like there's just. It's still only this tiny little thing. There's but way there more. There was this top, and then there was a shelf, and, and then, then a way at shelf. the bottom. So we have to keep bending down on the ground every time. This is way better, and the one was thirty bucks. Next item. Next item is a pair of Vans. These have like a Southwest print on them. Like a like a bull like a bull skull on there, and like different. Yeah, stuff. something like that, and it sold for forty five dollars shipped. Those were I think seven or eight bucks at a garage sale, so it was pretty good. They just looked cool, so I grabbed them. That's usually what I do with vans. We're looking for something cool, unique, one of the themes, or very cheap, good quality ones will sell. Yeah. Next up, another iPad box, guys. We're sell I can't believe we're selling so many of these. I've just been telling you guys not to waste your time, and <laughs> they keep selling. Yeah, that's a bestie buy. Um, it is just the Wi-Fi thirty two gig, just the cheese 
easy one and it sold for $15 shipped. So that one sold pretty well. And again, we've sold probably six or so now. We have one more to show you guys. Sneak peek for what's coming. Then we got an Aris um, modem. And this one comes with the wire and a Ethernet. Ethernet cord, and it sold for twenty-seven dollars shipped. This guy believes a drop shipper because he sent make he changed the address and he said they're selling for different prices somewhere. So I think we've got a couple bucks in this and a big electronics buy. So good deal there. It was listed at thirty something. Then we have this cool World War One Army motor transport knobby. Who would have see that? Can I just copy the list. It's got guys? like a helmet with. Um, it looks pretty cool, actually. Like a wing on wings on the helmet. Yeah, it's almost like. Oh, you probably can't really see it, but. Uh, looks like a turkey. <laughs> Anyways, it's pretty <laughs> cool. A little pin. And it sold for thirty-five dollars shipped. And I don't remember where this one came from. If it came from the Salvation Army buy or where it came from, but pretty cool. I think it may have come from actually the. The Stone Rolling Stones by now that I think about it. Maybe. Then we've got a sealed cop sealed this is sealed yes you're correct I, I, I almost said copy a sealed triple e oh a sealed board game a sealed board game oh copy it's a sealed board game of Card triple game. e deluxe um and it's from the flow buy this is from um the hirsch buy i call it flow because it was flow bees but then i talked to the guy more in his name this hirsch well he goes by hirsch so cool guy in our area we bought all that stuff from him you weren't there. But, and um, this one sold for $33 shipped. If you're watching Hirsch, we love you. Hope you guys are doing well. <laughs> Next up, we got a pair of Sony headphones. <sighs> Sorry, guys. These are big, man. These are like... I need these as big as my head is, actually. They're they pretty... actually fit on your they head. They do fit nice. <laughs> these look like normal size, head size headphones, but... I mean, for you, they're like, whoa! Well, they look big on my hair. Whoa. And those sold for thirty dollars shit. These are like a two dollars at a garage sale. They got a little wear on here. I just didn't feel like replacing the little ear earmuff piece or whatever it is, but still sold. Next up we got a Tamagotchi. We just sold the four pack the other day. These are our last one though, huh? No, we have it. one more. We have one more left. Um this is a cutesy one, it's like a rainbow like rainbowish kind rainbowish of kind, of. kind of, yeah. And it's weird. it sold for twenty five dollars We sold the whole set for how much? Sixty five? Sixty five. For four of them. Probably would have been better to sell them individually. Or maybe this one may have been worth more. I don't know. I only have a couple extra, so pretty good there. We spurned those for five bucks. They're gonna go that's gonna go first class for sure. And then we've got um a book, The Art of Beach Volleyball. From the three fifty, but I know that. Book's oh. falling apart though. Yeah, it's falling apart. And it sold for $20, $21 and some change. Okay. Another iPad Air box. Last iPod box for today, right? This is the 64 gig and it is sold cool. for $15 and some change. So pretty good there. Those go out first class. We're just shoving <clears throat> them in the big bowl of ours, right? Yeah. So sure. we've got this lot of eight Diary of a Wimpy Kid books. These are actually fun. I liked reading these when they came out. I was an adult when these came out. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. No. <laughs> Anyways, um, Diary Room Kid Books, eight of them sold for 24 ships. You got to collect yourself for a second. Um, they used to sell really well a long time, but you get like 50 bucks for the set. I don't think it's anywhere near that now if you have all 12 or 13 or whatever it is. Um, but if you can find them for cheap, get you can lot them up and do all it's better to have the complete set. But we'll make a little bit of money on those. Oh, here's a nice little piece. This is a Dyson part. From our friend's Dyson, they broke and they gave it to us. Oh, yeah. So this is the side airway inspection This pipe. piece always sells. And that piece sold for $18 shipped. Yeah. Shout out to our friends. They knew to give us their old junk because we could make some money. <laughs> then we got a Billy Joel vinyl. This is an innocent man, and it is from the vinyl buy, and it sold for $9 and some change. Not a whole lot on this one, but it does look cool. You know, Billy Joel and everything. He's a good musical talent for sure, but not as valuable as a... Resell. Then we got a pair of Gray's Anatomy brand um, scrub bottoms. These are a medium petite, and these are out of a Bestie buy, and they'll sell for $24 shipped. Yeah, you know, when she says Bestie, it's the main guy I buy from. She calls him my Bestie, but that sold for $24. Bucks. We spent $20 bucks on a whole bag of scrubs, and that was the only um, Gray's Anatomy one, but I lotted up some other ones. Sing it. <laughs> no. Oh, we then we got that. a PS3 game. Uh -huh. This is Grand Theft Auto 5. And that one sold for $12 shipped. All right. And I think that's everything. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully there will be some more things to show you tomorrow. Linda will be back for sure. And um, if not, we'll see you guys this weekend with what sells. Take care. Bye-bye.